Psalm 46, verse 8. Come, behold the works of the Lord, what desolations he hath made in the earth. Now, the word that I want to look at is that word behold. And it's such a beautiful lesson here for all of us, especially in these days of bad news. Behold is usually the translation of the very common word in Hebrew, hine. When you say hine in Hebrew, you're saying, just look at this. It's looking with the natural eye. You can look at the tree. You can look at the sky. Just look at something. Hine. But this word is not hine. It's the translation of a word chazar. Chazar. And that is a very interesting word. It's the word used for the prophet's vision. In fact, the word for vision is chazon. But the, the prophet has chazar. When he looks at a situation, he doesn't just hine it, he doesn't just behold it. He's got chazar. He has chazon, he has vision, and he can see the inner meaning of what's going on. So where, whereas other people, ordinary people, will just see what's going on, they see Jerusalem desolated and in a mess, the prophet looks and he sees with the inner eye of vision the Chazar, he looks at it in that way, and he can tell you what the significance of this is with regards eternal things, with regards the Lord, how the Lord sees the desolation of Jerusalem. And that's why I've been saying that we can rejoice in the Lord, even though there are desolations in the earth today, because it's God's work. You can only say that if you've got Chazar, and not just Hine. People get depressed because all they do is behold. They just read the news, they just see the videos, they see the news, and, and all they're doing is hine, they're beholding it, they're seeing it. But those people, and that should be us, beloved, who have got chazar, are able to see beneath the surface. In other words, hine is, if you like, sight. But chazar, that of the prophets and that of Christians filled with the Spirit, is insight. We've got insight, secret knowledge, if you like, of what is going on in the news. And that's why we don't delight, obviously, in the bad news, but we delight that God's will is being fulfilled and the earth is filled with the glory of the Lord. Let's pray for Chazar so that we can see the inner meaning and explain that to other people. Amen.